How's everybody doing? Uh, I've been getting a lot of requests to do a guitar tutorial video on uh, I'll Drink to That. So today we're going to uh, walk you through the different guitar parts that we used on that song on our last album. So and uh, I'll play the riff one more time for you guys so you can see it uh, up close. It goes, the first exercise is this. After the drum intro, it goes like this. So, breaking that down for you uh, slowly. First finger uh, on the fifth fret. Top E. Big E. Whatever you want to call it. It doesn't matter. Probably get some flack for what I call the, the big E string, but the big E, uh, fifth fret. And then the D string, the seventh fret. And then you're going to hammer on from the fifth fret D to the seventh fret D like this. And you're going to ping off of the G string on the fifth fret. And then you're going to go from the 7th fret D back to the 5th fret D back to the 7th fret D so you put it all together and it sounds like basically and then after the intro riff uh, of that, when I start singing, it just goes from G to A, the third fret, you know, fifth fret bar chord. And then from 3 2, which is C bar chord, to 5 2, which is D. And then at that point, you're going to start doing that old uh, kind of swing kind of riff. And you're going to go to E on 7-2. Basically, that's how that goes. And then uh, when I say 7-2, by the way, that means 7th fret, 2nd string, bar chord. Some people get confused. That's just how I learned it. I kind of made that up. It's not... Uh, exact science or anything. A lot of my playing is very improv. It's not very technical. I'm not very uh, technical guitar player. Um, the next riff, a lot of people ask about this one. It's not technical or anything, but they always seem to ask about it. At the end of the, um, the chorus, it does these two riffs, if you will. It goes uh, like this. <laughs> To break that down slowly, it goes hammer on from the 5th fret D string to the 7th fret D string. And then from the 7th fret A string to the 6th fret A string. Back to the 7th fret A string. 5th fret A string, 3rd fret A string, and then pull off, and then strike an A chord at the end of it. So to, to play the whole entire spectrum of the riffs that I just showed you, and again you can get online and look this song up and, and follow along with it, but it would go after the drum intro. <laughs>
hope that was very informative to everybody who's asked me about that song. Uh, I look forward to hearing from you guys, and uh, our record will be out pretty soon. Thank you, guys.